Still there? Yep. Still recording. Hey everybody, this is Joe. I bought some chicken, went and got groceries, got some fried chicken. So we're gonna have fried chicken and gonna have some corn on the cob. And then I'll probably make some mashed potatoes and gravy. Cutting this thing open so I can get the corn on the cob out of here. Okay. Some of these packages I swear I don't really expect to get them more than much better. Still there? Yep. Still recording. I'm trying to look for some gravy. What? I'm talking to the camera. I'm just gonna make some of this Fortis mashed potatoes. And I'm gonna put some brown gravy. So I'm gonna mix that up. Potatoes take two cups of water. Okay. Got these things for the corn on the cob. Probably seen these pulling for it. Kind of neat. I don't have my glass on because I get there we go. Now myself I like to cut the corn off the cob because I don't like to try and bite it off with my dentures. So that's what I do. Okay, I got my two cups of water for the taters. I'm not going to start warming that up until these frozen cob, corn on the cob start warming up. And the gravy, I can get it at least mixed up and I won't start cooking it either yet. But I can get it mixed up and get it on the, get it on the stove. Whisking in my gravy now, getting mixed up. This side of the burgers, I got them memorized. This one I still get mixed up. Okay, that's cooking. Gotta wait for a while. Guess I could fill up my water jug. Went and got groceries today. They Walmart had a bunch of sales on on uh, leftover Valentine stuff, seventy five percent off. 
these cookies, you only get 10 of them, but regular they're like $4.98 and it's marked down 75%. So they cost $1.12 for that package. And then I got these little cupcakes, they were the same thing, $4.98 marked down to $1.12. Take 75% off. And then These little M&M's in the heart, Brock's or Hershey's, they were regular $1.24 before, then on sale, 75% off, cost me 31 cents. It got me like eight of them. So I spent about five bucks all together. <clears throat> Pretty good savings, that's the best time to buy a lot of that stuff. I mean, for us anyway. When we had kids here, then it's a different story. Then we kind of had to. We don't have that no more. And grandkids are big. And we don't live that close, so we don't bother doing it. Buying stuff ahead of time. So I'm going to quit for now until I get my corn warmed up. I'll be back later. I'm going to get the chicken out put on the plate. Man, last night Glenda was sneezing a whole bunch, and then she took a couple Benadryl, I think. And last night I went to the bathroom after I went to bed, and I sneezed a couple of times, and man, it just feel like I pulled a muscle in here, my ribs. Just so now when I blow my nose or cough or anything. It, Kind of bothers me. It hurts like a dickens. Got this chicken from Walmart too. Eight piece. I don't know if you see that or not. I usually get a, a breast and a wing, and she gets a thigh and a leg. So what I'll do is I'll. Take out them pieces. There's the leg. And there's a breast for me. There's a wing for me. And oh, here's a here's a thigh, small one. That's for her. Put this back in the fridge. My corn's starting to melt, starting to boil. So what I'll do is I'll put all it all on here, and I'll just microwave it for a couple minutes when everything's getting close to being ready. All right, corn. Corn is starting to get soft. So I guess I can go ahead and start these knives so I can cut my corn off. I got knives so I cut corn off. These things. Put them over here. Now you just take two cups of water and get it to boil, then you pour this in and shut the, shut the heat off. And this mix of that are just instant potatoes, but we get we like the four cheese. That's I don't know why Linda's voice she can't hardly talk. It's kind of like the laryngitis. It gets crackly and then now it's just she don't have much of a voice voice right now. really know what causes it. But that's why I'm doing what I'm doing is give her a break. I smoked for over 50 years and my mistake was I was taking well butrin. I've had like two or three bottles, went to two or three bottles. But 
my trouble was I kept buying a pack or so just to have a ring on, just kind of like a security blanket, I guess. Well, Friday, I had two cigarettes. I had one left, and I had one Saturday morning. And then yesterday and today, I haven't had any, haven't even taken medicine for it. So, see how it goes. I'm getting kind of grumpy. But I've went through that before, but I am putting on weight. <laughs> it's getting hard for me to button my pants. I keep going to Walmart debating whether to buy another pair that's bigger, but I haven't yet. I'm still able to get them buttoned. But. <sighs> I don't remember being this... I might have been this heavy last year. I don't know. I can't remember. Turn the gravy down. It's getting... Basically waiting on my taters and the water for my potatoes now. Corn's getting tender. Getting closer. <clears throat> that thing's still recording. Yep. Okay. That was kind of weird. I was getting low on this. Great value olive oil. And it was actually 20 cents higher than Pam olive oil. So I got Pam today. The same the same here can was four four seventy or four eighty four and the Pam olive oil was four sixty four. So I got the Pam instead. It just don't make sense. Usually the grape value is cheaper. I don't know. So I was getting low on it, so I thought I'd get another can of it. Everything's getting expensive. Gee. I used to be able to get out of Walmart for 120, 130 bucks. Now it's 160, 170. Buying the same stuff I used to buy. Groceries went up that much. Just nuts. Start cooking my chicken, warm it up. What I'll do is I'll get one of these. See what I'm doing? Cutting it off. Uh, I was going to show you how I was cutting up the corn. You've probably seen this before. As you can see, we use a fine china.
with here. We got chicken, mashed tears and gravy, and some corn. I like a little pepper on mine. Well, I guess that's about it for now. We'll see you later. We're gonna eat. A heart speed to the city streets. We begin to feel the fire. 